get a little bit more in the local supermarket so I did and I got some milk and then I went off to Germany and I thought you know what let's fuck it we've already so imagine having a brain drink for your whole breast of water for one year take your organs and think you read your own last there and keep them up for four points on for a whole year to finish the joke in full but we can it's a right? Oh no, that's how I'm doing it. It's that. You niggas audacious. Wait a minute, did I see that some of the other game was the best? Some of the stuff you released from the 1st of January 2019 to the 31st of December 2019? Hmm. I lied. Local fish wanna try ting. Oh man, the audacity. I got girl in my inbox telling me eyes. Living on the edge to the end of our lives. Wolf in the sheepskin telling me lies. Sometimes I love when my enemy dies. Woo! So ahead of my time. Mainstream boy starts let. This talk is just so much marvelous. This is what Grand Prize to me. Whenever I think of hard going from, this still comes to mind. I just love everything about the song. This other song is what is okay for me. I roll out with no cash on me, calm now with no mash on me. The song starts up with a heavy young intro and so he fits in with his tightest prison's career. It's just how they thought it's just a perfect world for all words. You pussy hoes are not bad for me. Mad man, they go mad for me. This one, this one, this one perfectly acts as a as a great build up for one for what we call our veteran song and and it's a more of a satisfying drop in movie going history. Look who fish wanna try ting. Oh man the audacity I got girl in my inbox. And then this one was included in so much emotion. Sometimes I love when my enemy dies. Woo! So ahead of my time, mainstream boy starts letting off live. Amazing. The next part of the song is way more interesting. The only thing that's probably roughing and the boss of this verse perfectly describes his kind of broad, well-known artist in the UK. Yeah, the problem's back, I've got flows. Watch your back, come on smoke. Dodge the paps and do bolt. A problem with well-known artist in the UK rap scene. Saying, saying, and it's less, it's just how people don't think it's just a bit of hell. You think it's disgusting that that after all is of God, so people don't don't we describe him as a major grown man. It's a it's a comic and and that on both sides. This thing by your own, use my pink to sting fry your dome. No, this song has this has to do God, but it's actually a pop star, which he's not. I'm not Drake, of course. And he does this in so much class as it perfectly sells. Except so the guy who be angry with Mr. K was going a woman to break free from this mold. Oh, screw why I came and shook my whole era. No cosigns for me and no carers. 2019, I swear I've gone clearer. Drop full of dead MCs like Paul Bear. With love. Yeah, but I mean, that's um, perfectly right. I think you and Doc are having more rage behind it. Behind it. Uh, anything about his verse is something incredible. I don't know if you can begin to, to the end. And then this song has a verse from Send this K no Harry in my track suit says bow me in Parry. Hold on, Heady one! The guy who made so much brave about one big dream of Marcus who we actually think is kinda of shit I what it does. So I guess I, I did not like brave and I still don't like it. It's so lame and boring and it's so it's so dull, I seriously can't get into most of his own stuff. Why are you in here? Now we got beef for the streets and I thought only be in my patty. Cause I learned how to work this handy, not to just part us candy. I'll tell you why he's here, because he's fire. He has to play the for me on this song, the Sea Saga. Every one of the song has more depth to his verse. I'm not eating Jennifer and he's a toe down trying to be the best I can be. Let's try to go. Do you say the same song? Do you say yes about how people think he's just fit as a nice song about being a rapper and 
I'm writing a pencil. This is what the world's story. It was a heavy one. And it's so heavy. Absolutely fantastic. Close pay girls wanna out me. They want me on a box like chicken chow mein. I wanna white us wanna try me. I love the song ends with this amazing outro where Sui shares his phone thoughts about the song. Son, this is flesh on me. Stay away from these pagan youths. Can't many men, they wish death on me. Where do you know me from? Where do you know me from? Where do you know me from? Hey, I'm gonna allow it, I'm gonna allow it. Then I went off to Germany. I thought, you know what, let's fuck it. We've already gone this fucking far. Let's try and go all around the world. So I went to Russia and then I went down to Thailand, Singapore, and even Australia. I'm going on during the time I feel there's no one to save me. Obviously, you know, became the biggest sing song of, of 2019 and one of the worst hit songs of 2019. I was worried that the UK had gone crazy with making this sort of the big songs of the year. And, and this is even known from now on. And that was never, never a biggest sing song of the year, which would be doing this to me at my bestest. We get, we would just get more from these out there. That's not stuff. And the UK would never redeem himself from it. And then 2020 happened, and this masterpiece piece is going to top our year around this year. By the way, yes, I am filming in my younger video on this segment as well. Boys in the mood, fuck around like a brand new. I ain't trying to tell you what to do, but try to play cool. Baby, I ain't playing by your rules. Everything look better with a view. Man, what a great, fun, enjoyable chat pop song which deserves to set out chocolate charts for a week did in October. I have been wanting to talk about this one in depth for months. And I finally can now. I own for long enough. Maybe you can show me how to love. Maybe. After I talk about my life, of course, again. Now, now this one, of course, some of take me by the uh -huh. I never want my favorite songs, songs all time. For, for just the reasons that sounds amazing. Amazing. I do think this song presents the music in a different way. I'm waiting. I'm a weekend special, it's different, they come on, this is basically taking me by, by a heart, which is something which, which I'm not complaining about. <laughs> yeah, I love the weekend news and the fact that this is severe to take me by a heart, by a very big advantage. This is probably one of those best performance of the song in the whole of 2020. Frankly, you just sound so amazing and hateful. City's cold and empty No one's around to judge me I can see clearly when you're gone Oh, oh He sings, I don't see, he's fantastic uh, That's it, and of course he's just iconic One of the one of the most miserable courses of all time. I'm never gonna get this shit out my head, but I don't mind because it because it's so enjoyable and this job is so great that I just listen to it and I already feel satisfied forever whenever I hear it. Yeah, sure, this, I'm not 
wait, are they all quite pissed? I'm going through a drought. You don't even have to do too much. You can turn me on with just a touch, baby. Hey, come on. Who listens to this one for a little content? Yeah, yeah, pretty much it's no one. No one. People listen to it for the music, of course. So. This time, I said. Fantastic. I'm so about to let you know. I can never say it on the phone. Don't ever let you know. This time. Yes, so we can say it was perfect. Yes, he's great, but it's the best thing for us all. And like, come. And like, everything about, about this part, 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 it's probably some of the best. I'm a bridge is just heavenly. My god. It's just has amazing. You know really cages and level weekend sounds. I know, I just love this bridge so well. I, well I remember being at the Paul did this so much emotion and I heart it, it it's just absolutely incredible. The photo bus that's just adds so much to all days of depth to this oh this already fantastic songs. To make it absolutely amazing, amazing. When I hear this, I just imagine myself, myself, the very double high streets of London, London in December. I like five o'clock in the evening, at like, at like a hundred miles per hour. Looking at all the Christmas sites around me and just jamming to this. This is a song which, which I will remember in 10 years' time and probably still be jamming to with my kids. <laughs> Honestly, when I first heard this song, I thought that this is easy to be locked with a top on this list as I thought that. Nothing can be beat with pure mastery of this song. This is, this is not even, even the best song to hit number one in the UK this year. No, that goes to me by 24k gold and featuring A and D. Girls, obvious elephant in the room. We're part of it, don't act so confused. No. Yeah, yeah, I've heard all the complaints about how this song is very cheap and about how it's a test and about how Ian Gill's part is stupid. Honestly, I like the problem with this with the facts, really. But I think the production of this song is absolutely fantastic. Why you always in the mood? Fuck around like I'm brand new. I ain't trying to tell you what to do. I said how catchy this sounds. The guitar song is in. So very amazing, and yes, the number three is very cheap, but it makes an absolutely iconic melody that sticks in your head on numerous occasions. They look better with a view, I can never get attached, when I start to feel I am attached, somehow I was in a feeling bad, maybe I am not your dad. Whenever something comes on the radio, or, or maybe on my iPhone success, I just get into a very, very good mood. All the time, 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 and yes, the results didn't say that much, but come on, it, it doesn't need to change at all, well. it's perfect the way it is. Love to avoid the depression, we've been here before, and I won't be a victim. It's like, seriously, how can you not love this energy? It's absolutely fantastic, you can help keep them. I just did it more to this. So why you trying to pay your love on a regular? When you could be blowing up, just let me show you love. I bet we have a performance from some hair here, and they sound great. Are you even not a fan of Angel K. Golden or as a performer? I actually found a picture of Angel with Faye Mediocre, and the rest of the performance is a pretty dis disappointing as well. I think that's how I like his, his part of the song. It looks like this. I will never let a shorty go and set me up. The melody is so poppy. Poppy, rest in confidence. 
C'est un coup, on va se rouler, je pense que c'est... Allez, ça y est, ça nous descend nous aussi, oui. Oui, on va se rouler, je pense que c'est... Il va nous aussi, oui, Seigneur. I'm talking slick back, kick back, gang, sipping 40s. You keep playing that another day with your shorty. I ain't complete to be very wrong. On met some medieval, on not. So, I do you know, in the old, that's exactly the same. People say that this, that this is hobbies. So, so, for some reason. I don't see Uncle Bush on that. I don't see, I don't see very focused. He says great on this. I think it's mad the ass, but see how oh, he's on the bridge. Seems a love to avoid the depression. He's actually fantastic with that, which is probably one of my favorite parts of the whole song. So he just says great on this song, what I say. In fact, I think he's as good on this one as Triple K Golden. We've been here before and I won't be. He's that good on here. 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 Every day, it's man, they all mix bag. Very little thing, you can check and have a younger video to see me through the sex. I mean, this is what we're going to the song. Yeah, I know. Did you, did you see this would be annoying as, as stupid from these songs? You know, see, I want you to listen to this song. You know, it's so really. I thought it needs to be more, more about young love and being stupid and having your legs or experiences. We just thought, but yes, and this how, and this how people learn from their mistakes. You to do, but try to play cool. Baby, I ain't playing by your rules. That's it, but I don't want the legs on this song. Because they're all coming from a stupid teenage girl who doesn't make a world of relationships. Yeah, it was the one who already doesn't care. This match fits, that was wet before you know me. Got a lot of love, but you better save it for me. We play games a lot. Care, I don't care. I mean, seriously, you know that vessel he doesn't know what it was. I mean, listen to these lines. No, is he just going up and finding the world relationships? As he fair, it doesn't sound like the, like the other person is in this, in this relationship. She just be cares about this. Either. I mean, listen to what he says about his girl. You have started it, now I'm in the mood. Now we arguing in my bedroom. We play games. Oh. Neither of these two people were interested in this relationship. They're just doing it to get away from the stress of the hard voice about it. Play games of love to avoid the depression. And even maybe doing it versus not helping you. It's about learning from your mistakes. They just don't even try to figure out how to end the relationship if it's the only thing you're holding on to, which may sound weird to some people. But, but for me, it perfectly cancels the idea of being in your first, first relationship and not knowing anything about the world. But I think what I love most about the song is that's just how short it is. You always in the mood, fuck around like I'm brand new. Just like the length of the whole song. It's only about 2 minutes and 20 seconds long. I mean, I've got 140 seconds overall. Overall, I've got so many songs. This song means all its songs to the best. It's like anyone, hey, you can go to the list of getting along so quickly as it was drag over. As, as like I said, there isn't much to this song. <laughs> Not some noise. Noise. Right. It's a bright side piece of musical joy and it is in space. That's just probably why it, why it ended up being my best paid song for 2020 over even, even my number one of the year. It's so easy to listen to. That's a dead thing that's a waste of time, time to come from. This one just seems like a, a fun cut of breath. And that's why I listen to it, to get that enjoyment in life. Especially in 2020, this one always puts a smile on my face. Face. I said this one's a sick of me from 2021 and beyond. I don't think this one will ever get over me. In fact, 
I don't think it can even get old. These these songs are some of my favorite you can can know all the time. These songs deserve to be remembered for decades to come. Come. Because that's what's that's a a really consistent share fun. I love these songs. Well the UK I say you the you redeem yourself in twenty nineteen and the Capogi virus. I don't cool it because why not? Till I feel your touch Everything better with you, yeah. Let me go. So then after that, I went down to a city. I think it was Brisbane. I'm not entirely sure. Probably. And then I thought, okay, I've gone a bit too far. So I might call my dad. I call my dad. He told me, what the fuck are you doing? I remember back in 2016, I said to the team, where I somehow, how hate the DJ message. I actually hated his stuff. Um, his stuff. Um, I remember back in 2016, so I was playing some team where really I hated DJ Masters. I don't know quite why I did, but, but I actually hated this guy. But honestly, looking back, he really was that bad. Right hand in the air, a solid swell. I never fuck a bitch if she don't do her hair. Honestly, looking back, but I said he wasn't a bad producer at all. At all. So he really wrote about some like Mimi Yuka Jones and Vicky Wink. Obviously, looking back, the beats I see you to them more. Well, obviously, they will probably the thing is make this song fair as well. And by the way, the real free song is what you do actually be like and listen to to this day. See, they have a really like the same like Hover, his 2014 sub film. No, here's some pieces of dots and set and I'll make some much less music. For example, I keep a hundred racks since I my jeans. I remember hitting them all with a whole team. Now nah, nigga can't ask a call cause I'm balling. I was waking up getting racks in the morning. I was broke, now I'm rich, these niggas salty. I love this song. I love this song this time. This song is, is amazing. I, I mean, it's not a second time where this song is on. Well, I don't actually love listening to it. Anything about this is absolutely beautiful. Oh, it just sounds so nice and chill. It never sounds so wrong. Right. If it doesn't just sound so obviously with, with all the best sounds in this room, proof I've ever heard on oh, a song in the end. The, the piano noise in the beginning of the song actually um, sounds amazing sounding. I jump into the bloody bottoms is underneath, cause all my niggas got out the streets. I think I'll just say relaxing and fun to listen to. I, I'm perfectly catching the chill atmosphere. This one's going to be one of the best way possible sound wise. I think the most interesting is actually amazing. It just makes me feel like I'm on the beach in the middle of summer. Summer. Summer this morning, just slowing down on the sound. He's these thoughts are missing each other and make one of the most wonderful intros of all time. And then that beat drop happens. Remember hitting them all with a whole team. Now nigga can't ask a call cause I'm balling. After this song is extreme passion. This is as much for me something so even more exciting and exhilarating. I am for how this fan sounds. Uncle fronted me some peas, had they getting birds back. We came up on dirty money, I gave it a bird back. It's like a guy who did not quite worry in a miserable hot tub this morning and just enjoying life as it is. It just sounds so exciting and fascinating to me. I'm a best compliment that thing is so freaking well. See you running y'all gang of your soup woo. Got a new all in bitch and that pussy voodoo. And I'm a nigga now. Who knew? Whoa. Whoa. But when things are this song, you know, it doesn't really way change. That was us not much. I mean, it's just more of a mood. It, it actually changes quite a bit, thinking about it, but it will sound the same fashion noise. 
Cause all my niggas got it out the streets I keep a hundred racks inside my jeans And it wasn't slow The rest of them call it was Good for some more amazing Amazing company So it was just That's a fun way Yeah, I remember Both of us I remember hitting them all with the whole team. Now a nigga can't answer calls cause I'm balling. I was. Oh, okay, does that mean the movie with some some actually really is great on here? Here, melody and the focus is a very big vibe for me. Sometimes he sounds good on his songs, songs, and sometimes he doesn't. It's like how I like his. I was waking up getting racks in the morning. I was broke, now I'm rich, these niggas salty. All this. If I got up on a lean, I'm a sip sip. I run a wrestle with my queen like London and Nick. This song is basically about poverty and we're coming up from it and becoming a famous rapper. So, yeah, this song is kind of about rap, rap because this is what's so well because we're still rich and we're depicting rap through it all the time. I got rich on all these niggas, I didn't forget back I had to go through the struggle, I didn't forget that I had this out of the Maybach and now I can sit back This is me, Shazzy, oh yeah I don't know what you can say he made that Cause I'm getting money now, I know you heard that Young nigga on the corner, bitch, I had to serve crack Like how he's grown up to be It's such a good rapper Especially he looks like this, me, Shazzy The fact that, 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 that has to work hard to get here, which is way more better than what Benjamin Vice does and what was more, more Drake Rich. He thinks Drake has to do absolutely nothing, nothing to get where he was, and instead of going, going off for a season, the pissy sound did. Uncle fronted me some peas, had they getting birds back. We came up on dirty money, I gave it a bird back. Cut off the brain. That's why his original like, song is so sad, sorry, because he's talking about. How he had to work hard for Buffy to get to this point. Not really about how he don't know he is here. Yeah. Then I get my bitch a new coup. Either you run a yard gang or your suit whoop. Got team. I've been waking up to get the money. Whoa, whoa. Got a bad bitch ass. Tell it, whoa, whoa. Yeah, every bitch, my God. It has so much more motion to the song. The production takes a duck to you as well. He talks about his life right now. And as well. Like, his fame, fame. Yes, he may have a word for it of his own. Oh, to venture to my toes. Two twins, I'm fucking them both. I put it. But obviously, the rest of it is obviously almost perfect. Perfect. I, I, I was paying, paying, paying this verse of my part just, just makes it way, 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 way better. I lemonade. Got my baby mama that new Bentayga. And the final course. Hits and then if he comes to you with a mask button, or you're pulled, joy. And I'm all with a whole team. Now nah, nigga can't answer calls cause I'm balling. Joy, which is absolutely incredible. Everything you put about with one of course, which is so funny to hear and I love it. That's how I was wrong, but for my fault, but DJ Mustard was a bad producer. This is one of the best sounding rap songs I've heard in my life. Like, I can honestly, in, in every other year, this song would be number one easy. I could have easily put this song at the top of my list and feel no regret that much at all. This song can't talk with this, and it never made perfect sense. And I probably agree in my opinion 
So we're going absolutely in any day of the year. Whether we or not, it was my favorite song of the year. Then I saw release this year, which I loved even more than this. A song which I couldn't do with any else on this list other than number one. What song was it? Well... Went over, got a walk, and then I came across a snake. And it almost tried to bite me, but I told it to fuck off because snakes there are pretty venomous. And then, wait, what the hell's going on? Okay, so did you ask a fucking top twenty list? I would say the ten bullies are only one. Maybe it's the facts of all the rules from there. But, but I was talking to you previously, and I gradually reveal it, but um, here's the thing. What the board is as if you wanted by the IS. And you say, as long as I. I don't care. I don't fucking care. I fucking don't care. I don't care about this is as any reason since this is my favorite song of the year. I don't care about this song came out of in 2019 and I technically mentioned it in my own mentions last year because I only mentioned it because, because I wanted to give it a shout out. I knew even back when I made the year that this song would be in my 2020. That's just so yeah. And then back in January, which by the way really, really still gives us this one great and probably really some way this is. This, this one kicked me in a way that this one has ever uh, done. And it, and, and it then became my favourite song of all time. Nobody even noticed I saw them standing. This is not one of my favorite songs of all time. This, this is my one favorite song of all time. Like, like number one on my list of my favorite songs of all time. I'll get back to why I think that later. But first, it's a noisy actual song. It's the best. I had a dream. I got everything I wanted. Oh, best. Using it as it is like incredible or phenomenal wouldn't be just doing it justice. I didn't lose us before in the year and I would be worth nothing to you in this song. Not what you think. It is just the sisters these other songs. I think it was it, that is probably why the songs are so good to me. Sometimes they have a little emotion, like in the cases of Ocean Eyes and one of the parties over, and it's like in the cases of Bad Boy and Before I Am. Bad Boy said this is easily his best work he's, he, he's ever done. And if I'm being honest, it might have been a nightmare. Done. His only song is perfect. It's, it's just perfect. There's not one thought of the song. I didn't think think of the game with such a sort of animation. To anyone who might care. To the chorus where there's this explosion best way possible. If I could change the way that you see yourself. The part of the second best where Billy vocals get Get a bit distorted, which by the way is still great. I tried to scream, but my head was underwater. Still good, which just sounds absolutely am am amazing. What they said will go straight to my head, what would they say instead? The greatest is one of the greatest moments in music history. 
to be the closest shelter, heartbreaking and immersion, which, which lets you feel various pain, pain in the song and, and makes you feel very, uh, I just, uh, I absolutely killed the men. Today, the show is a part of waking the racial, racialism, which is the film big, big pain in the sun's film. Because everybody wants something from me now, and I don't want to let them down. You big at how she sounds when she says that she dreams that, that she tried to kill herself and never care on women. Maybe you do feel it because it just seems so real and that's what makes the song so, so amazing. And that is one of the most amazing parts of, of a song I've ever heard. So I stepped off the golden. Mm. It's so satisfying when she wakes up and her love is there. There's a help page when we use hard drives. As long as I'm here, no one can hurt you. No matter what she's going through, he's there for her. And it's one of the most constant moments in music history. The way this film is being felt is absolutely incredible. That's why I don't say much. Would I do it again? Would I do it again? And then that's and then there's a, a, that amazing bit from just complimenting complimenting her whole life and thinking about what might happen if she wasn't there and, and telling herself not to make not to make anything happen and her dreams are good she did did some for her head and it doesn't matter because they aren't real. And she's dancing. Emotions in this song, what is song in a way that makes us one of the greatest pieces of written music, music of, of a past, I say, century. It just makes you feel big, it just makes you feel her pain, <laughs> her pain, and this pain. I just have always found. Do you want? None of the season is why this one is number one. The only part of this one's part is why this is my favorite song of all time. Why is it? Well... Obviously, obviously this one would be the time with this if it was just for most factors. It would probably be, be just two and three. And I call Ballroom the best song of 2020 and think nothing of it. But no, there is one thing. Something deeper. One single thing which led to this song to the top of this list. Well, I can't even remember if you ever been with you. I had a game where I got everything in one tip. Firstly, I decided to say that my personal connection to this song isn't necessarily exactly what Blink's was, and I interpreted it in a different way. I know, I, I know what this one's going for. And yeah, but this is how I, my personal connection to this song. So I know that this one's that, but it doesn't really stop me from seeing this. So yeah, just a disclaimer before I say about well. No, I'm not joking. I'm not being home from work. I actually kind of went through in real life what we did in this song. No, seriously, there was a dream where it was something so amazing that, that it kept me through the whole year. And, and it kept my brain so much that, that for me, this is what I remember trying to play it by. Okay, so all of this amazing thing I got in my dream that I always wanted, simple children. They called me weak, like I'm not just somebody's daughter. Basically, I had a dream in Germany where I got pregnant with twins. I know this is a little song's going on about, but I don't care. I can end it to this song, song immediately after I have that dream. I could go on forever with a whole story about me 
Kötü bir geçim sabah altı ayı çektiğin Öğretesin versin durumu sunmayın Hiç ki çeyincin Sunmayın ama sunmayın Sudayın farfın kutansın kubabla ağlayacağın Yine o harman I admit that I'm a prick at times. Sorry if I make you sick at times. The game wrong. Hit me up is phenomenal. It really is. It is seriously one greatest song ever made. I love it. The TV, the reason why this song is one of the one is the sheer fact that I don't connect with personally. All the years amount to nothing. Going nowhere, why you rushing? Buff as fuck, your DMs popping. It's a bit of a love song with amazing lyrics and amazing production. This ain't how it really goes, cause you're the one I thought to form. Oh, well, but I definitely threw it on a personal level. Anything I wanted, however, uh, I connect to it on nearly every level. It feels like yesterday was a year ago.